Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another manual graphics tutorial. Today in this tutorial we'll be learning how to make simple grass and uh, learning how to use the particle system to um, randomly position it because positioning grass can be a trick if you don't use the particle system. So this is an example, my fallen piece. As you see the grass is um, all randomly positioned which is great. Um, so let's get started. So the first thing we want to do is model our grass. So to do, I model my grass very simply. Um, I just add a cube and I scale it like that. And then I enter edit mode and select the top vertices. And then I click E and then I just stretch it out like so and um, what I'm gonna do to this grass is I'm just gonna taper the ends here and I'm just gonna make it a shorter base here so a bit of blade of grass and then I usually just um, duplicate these and just put them in a bit of random position and usually scale one down a bit and one up a bit so that just make sure they're all aligned and that is looking really nice simple blades of grass of course you can add detail um, to these but I'm just going to be covering the basics so make sure in cycles and just add a diffuse material and I'll just give it something like that I'll just pull grass and um, <coughs> I'm then going to then going to make my new batch of grass and that simply just move them over. That simply involves getting a cylinder and down here making it have three of vertices. Rotating it on the x-axis 90 degrees and scaling it on, on the y-axis quite a lot so we get like a triangle shape it's pointed up a bit and what I do with these triangles is I just duplicate it give it a bit of rotation and uh, scale it down and you can make these a lot thinner I think that's what I'll do Okay. Okay. Now let's um, select our grass. Hitting the B key and select our first grass, and then we're just going to click join, and then do the same with our second piece. join and of course you just go grass and then that is grass as well and we'll give just give these the same material just for the demonstrations today I'm also going to give it the viewport color and um, didn't need that light so that's our grass actually I'm going to give this a new grass too. I'll give it a dark shade. So that's how I make my low poly grass. Um, that's how I model them. 
the next step is using the um, particle system to randomly place this. So to set up for the particle system, you need to rotate them on the y-axis 90 degrees. And just move them down. Okay, now let's get working with our particle system. So to do that, we just add a plane. And usually I would add um, a bit of bumpiness to that. In fact, I might. Actually, no, I just won't add a modifier for this um, since it is just a demonstration. So I'm just going to go to our particle system over here. Click a new particle system, pull it across one, and we're going to change it from emitter to hair, and down here, object to grass one, rotation ticked, um, size, you want the random size on, and you also um, want to change the number of particles you can change up so 400 and um, you can also if you go where is it up that jitter, you want to tick rotation, and um, that seems quite good actually, and with this you can have get a really nice effect as usual, and I think that's That's all we need. Um, yep, you want it random, not jittered. Um, yep, that's all. Um, so that's simply how you use the particle system to add grass to your image. So thank you very much for watching and I shall see you